Hello, I'm a Pseudomonas originosa. I'm a naturally occurring bacterium that can be found in the environment all around you. And I'm a superbug. When I get into one of you humans, I can cause nasty infections at different sites all over your body. My two worst enemies are the phagocytes from your body's immune system, who eat me, and the antibiotics you use to treat infections, which kill me. However, I'm a sociable bacterium, and when my friends and I get together as a community, we form what is called a biofilm, otherwise known as a slime city. Grouped together like this, we are 1,000 times more resistant to your body's immune system and antibiotics than when we are on our own. This is dangerous for you because it means your infections spread and can even be fatal. This causes the NHS billions of pounds a year in treatment and is particularly problematic when infections occur at sites where you have medical devices fitted, such as venous catheters, heart stents, bladder catheters and endotracheal tubes. The key to understanding how and why we form biofilms is to know that we Pseudomonas originosas are decisive bacteria. There are surfaces that we love and others that we hate. When we approach a new surface, we feel it with our tail-like flagella. If we like what we feel, we stick down and grow little hairs called pili, which we use to attach firmly. But if we don't like what we feel, we swim away as fast as we can. As soon as one of us is securely attached at a surface, we send out messages to tell our friends to come and join us. Once they've also stuck down and we're all settled in, we start to excrete matrix molecules, which join together to form our biofilm. Inside of this, your body's immune system can't fight us and your antibiotics can't reach us, so your infections continue to spread. But... If you use super biomaterials that we bacteria don't like to make your medical devices, then your infections will clear up and you will save lives. If, however, we superbugs do succeed in forming a biofilm, then you have another option of fighting us. Drug delivery systems. This is a polymer nanoparticle, a small virus-like particle whose job it is to carry antibiotics into our biofilm. You can think of this like a bus that can drive into our slime city to drop its passengers off. Each passenger is like a snake, a polymer chain that holds a molecule called a biofilm disruptor in its mouth and an antibiotic particle beside its body. On entry to the acidic environment of our slime city, the snake drops these particles, which then cause havoc for us bacteria. The biofilm disruptors interrupt our messaging so we break apart from each other allowing your antibiotics and immune system to attack us. And ultimately, our biofilm is destroyed. The result of all of which is that your infections clear up and you can get on with your normal life. So, you can see how important this research is. If you use super biomaterials that we bacteria don't like to make your medical devices and use drug delivery systems to get your antibiotics into our biofilms to destroy them, then you will be better able to control the spread of infection, making treatment more effective, saving lives and saving the NHS billions of pounds. Leaving the only one unhappy about all of this, me, the Pseudomonas originosa. Not so super now, am I? Research matters.